Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today is Transgender Day of Visibility 2024. It's March 31st. Um, and so Transgender uh, Day of Visibility is all about um, kind of uh, just voicing the concerns of the trans community, um, encouraging um, safety and um, education while also trying to reduce discrimination against those uh, who identify as transgender. And transgender doesn't, the umbrella of transgender doesn't just include trans men and trans women, but it also includes folks who identify as non-binary, um, basically anyone who is not cisgender, meaning that they uh, don't identify um, with their uh, gender assigned at birth, um, then they, um, they fall under the trans umbrella, whether they are um, agender, um, non-binary, um, you know, demi-boy, like there's all of these classifications that fall under the trans umbrella and I want everyone to feel included in Trans Day of Visibility because you are visible, you do matter, your experience matters. Um, so I encourage if you are in the trans community to share your story today and talk about um, things that you're comfortable talking about, but just, you know, I think a lot of people don't, um, you know, they're like, you know, a lot of people don't even realize they know trans people um, because, you know, it's not something that a lot of us just announce, like, when we first meet people or something like that. So, um, so just, uh, you know, kind of pr promoting the cause, but do whatever you feel comfortable with. Um, I'm going to be personally working on several projects today. I'll walk through a lot of the projects that I do. Um, I finished a couple projects already. Um, so this one is a rainbow fidget toy um, keychain in the trans pride colors. Um, I know I could be better at sewing the edges, don't read me. Um, I also put a marble on the inside so that it could double as a fidget toy and it's a keychain as well. So someone could use it. Um, I did a video tutorial. So the video tutorial will be on my, um, on my second channel at Ian is a weirdo too. Um, two being the number two. Um, so I will be doing a video tutorial on how I crocheted this. I kind of added all the details, but you can pick and choose what you um, prefer to do with this. Um, and these are going to be released throughout the day, just so that um, I don't pile all these videos on you at once. I also talk about my coming out story part of it. You know, it's kind of hard to get into all of the details. And also, because I have had some more negative encounters, um, or less than positive encounters, um, since I've come out as trans, you know, I don't want to call anyone out because maybe they didn't react the way that I perceived as, like, the right way to react to things. Um, I also made this, uh, little trans alien. Um, I'm still, like, on the fence about the eyes, like, I'm not sure if I should do, like, black, um, some black on the eyes or not, but, um, this is a pattern that I got um, from the cryptids book that I got from my little sister, uh, for Christmas, so it was a very easy pattern to follow, and, um, very simple, uh, it's in four parts, the head, uh, two arms, and then the body, so it's very cute, I'm very happy with it, and you can make this in any size yarn with, uh, a multitude of size hooks, so that is great, and then I also am making a hat, so the hat will be gray all over except for this kind of like prism like streak of um the uh trans flag color so i'm really excited about that and can't wait to see how that looks these hats do tend to take a little bit longer than it seems to take everyone else so that's fine um and i'm also going to try to get some more projects done that i will re release throughout the day so if you're interested in any of the projects and granted even if you're not um trans and you want to make um, rainbow things, or, you know, the alien can be made in, in any color combination possible. Um, it's very cute, very easy to make, very beginner friendly. Um, and then this hat is also very beginner friendly and can be, uh, made in any colors. So, um, I just wanted to share that with you all. And, um, I hope to see you today. Um, if you have any questions about Trans Day Visibility, um, please feel free to drop them in the comments below. And, um... And uh, today we're just going to focus on positivity and um, raising each other up, embracing 
the differences and different stories that each of us has. Um, any blatant transphobia with no intention to have a conversation and learn from each other rather than um, change people's minds and uh, shove your own opinions down my throat or the throats of other people um, will not be tolerated. If you don't want to have a conversation like an adult, you won't be treated like one and you'll be kicked out and you get to go to timeout. So um, that's kind of where I'm at today, and uh, I really hope that you all enjoyed the videos that I put together for you. And, um, and yeah, so I hope you have a great Trans Day of Visibility, and I will talk to you later.